I'm going to do a tutorial on making a free forum. You don't have to have your own web space or mess around with confusing things to make a free forum. It's very easy to do. Now what we're going to do, we're going to use Forumation. We'll start right from the start. We'll make a new Gmail. We'll just make a new Gmail account. If I have to open a text file to save the details. to remember hopefully I won't get um, blocked because I do make gmails often and um, sign out of that obviously I've signed in one and up to center all this um, use another account create account okay create account Jeremy Martin uh, Jeremy Martin I'm going to say, say um, 2018 probably taken I'll have to censor this as well. I won't do it now. Simple password. Doesn't matter. What is this? Right. Use eight words. Okay. Eight. Stronger password, try mix of letters. Okay. Two thousand eighteen one two three. Right, that'll do. At gmail dot com. Let's try that. Okay, it's making me do another password. Um, no, that's not working. Okay, now I'll just censor this. No. That's just alright. Now hopefully it doesn't block me and require a phone number. So November 13, 1977. Gender mail. If you make emails too often, it will block you and has got a ever growing complex way of checking different kind of checkpoints to, to block you from making too many accounts. But it looks like I've made one, I've got through. Let's just clear that. Alright, we got a new Gmail account. Now, if you want to legitimately make a proper Gmail account and you've got a phone that you can sign it up with it, if they'll just ask for your phone number and give you a code. So let's go. We've got a new Gmail. Now, hopefully, I got that password right. Formation.com. Otherwise, I won't be able to log back in, log back into my Gmail. Doesn't matter, it's just for a test anyway. Create a free form. We go to www.formation.com. Simple, create a, few, create a new form. Right, well, let's make one. Um, four characters minimum. Jeremy Martin Anonymous. Oh, it's too long. Okay. I oh, know. Yeah, it's too long. 
Well, what we do? Jeremy Martin Anon. There we go, it's not taken. Title, Jeremy Martin Anonymous. This is test website to show a uh, test form show how to make one. You don't really need to fill in everything. Jeremy Martin Anon at formation.com. Oh, you should, depending on where you sign up, you can actually choose different domains and everything, but it doesn't matter. We can only choose one here. And we have to get their email address. Now, obviously, I'll have to censor this again. Our email address. Make a password. No, I haven't read, but I'll just tick it anyway. Prove that you're not a robot. Okay. It's going to give me a... Simple verify. Touch the arrows to roll the ball. I think I'm, yeah, I think it's done. Discover my forum. Oh, password. Let's do that again. Let's try it again. Forum creation successful. That's how simple it was. Just a okay. It's been created. A validation key is necessary. Obviously, you need to confirm the email. I will have an email. There we go. There's my email. And click the following link. And that will validate and register my. There we go. Access the forum. Okay. Log in, admin, and it should be the default password. If it's not, the one that I made, log in automatically. There we go. We got a we got a forum. Let's save password. All right, what we'll do? We'll just drag and drop a in there. Or we can put it onto favorites, however you use add favorites and all that, whatever. <clears throat> okay, Jeremy Martin Anon.forummotion.com. Let's go to another browser. I'll load it and see if it works. And there we go. This is our, our forum now. We can obviously do a lot of things with this forum. Change a lot of things. Now, here's our forum here. We go first forum. It's got a default first message, your first subject. Some guide on how to do things and you can well work it all out from there and you can change a lot of stuff you can actually modify a lot of code internally in this to do a lot of weird shit you can choose a lot of you can swap to between different themes and different versions of BB code and all kinds of stuff so let's go to another forum I've made Build Wars now I made this almost 10 years ago Click to enable. What have I got to click to enable? I don't know why I've got that. But anyway, here we go. This is my Guild Wars website. Build Wars. Check that out. This is this is just the front page. See, I've made a flash on the front page. The shortcuts to things and music player. Go to Guild Wars 2. Which I've barely played, I can't stand it. So let's go in a forum. Now this flash up here is blocked. Now there's a what happened was Adobe end up making it so flash automatically blocks when you have to click to play. Now all these icons, all these see these menu items. I made all these. And they were animated. They were originally very animated. And I had to re redo them every one of them because the W blocked them. They get a big play sign and they'd all be blocked and you have to click play just to load every single one of them. So 
effectively my website didn't work anymore because Adobe fucked over Flash. I found a way to insert Flash into these from sections. I even did these open and close graphics, everything. I did it all. And so I had to just make simple images of, the, of those image versions, simply and unanimated image versions was the same thing. Now, if I go to on my administrator panel, which is, oh, damn, should be able to automatically log in. There we go. Administrator panel, general, categories and forums. Now, I see it says error on all these things. There's a reason why. We'll go to any one of them. Let's go to this one. You'll see it's got code in here and it's got break, a break command here. What it is, let's open another notepad. We'll copy this code. What it is, now I actually made it a way to load Flash and I had to shortcut the links. It's complicated how it worked. But now I've just got a simple web link to a PNG because I had to change it all. It's just a simple image SRC thing. Just you can do the same thing. Just make the make a, an image. Check all different file sizes and everything to work out what you want and to make it work. And important that you have to do is you have to put. I think you ever remember you have to put a break thing in there. I'm not sure if you did or you have to actually remove it completely, one or the other. I think if you save it when the brakes on, it'll actually add a space. That might be what it is. So you might have to actually remove it. So every time you go in here, it automatically adds a break command, which you want to remove if you save. I think that's how it works. So it's actually these are all invalid fields, but they they're actually different menu items. They just it does just got an invalid name. On the front end, it all works. On the on the back end, it all it comes up as invalid and stuff because it's it doesn't register this as a name. But it all works. And as you can see, it all works. Um, I've got all other kinds of stuff in this forum too. But let's go. Heading 19. Now, I've got, well, I've got my game inserted into a, into a page of my forum. Let's go age 18. Or headings, or whatever you want to call them. Here's another, my, uh, the other one was my boss fight, that's my thing. And you notice it says H17 forum, slash forum, that's not actually the name, that's the default name. If I go, you, this is important, it will make sense in a sec. Okay, I'm going to have to censor that. I, um, I think it's modules... HTML modules, HTML page management. Now these are all the custom pages. Now you can actually set one of them. Look, I've set this one uh, here as being the default page. As it, instead of loading straight to your forum like this one loads here, I can actually make my own web page as the home page, and I can actually make web pages and make my whole, whole website, a whole website from from that web page and you don't even need to use your form. You can make a whole website in there. I just insert code into the I'll show you how to do it in a sec. Now notice he heading two SWTOR uh, chat screen black they've got names. I've named them all. But what what's this? If I go to let's close all that. If I go to H19 boss, it works. Now if I do H19 forum, it also works. Now by default, if you're using these links, just in case you want to name them, it doesn't matter what the name, if you do H19 dash forum, that dash forum counts for any name that you name it. You can name it that web, you can rename that web page anything, as so long as it's under heading 19. If you do dash forum, it will it would it doesn't matter what the name is, it will still link the link will still work. So what was I gonna I was gonna say something important. Um so I'm gonna do the web pages. Oh, it was something important? What was it? You can insert flash, you can make it in web pages. Oh bugger, I've forgotten what it was that was important. 
Oh, I'm going to make show sure how to go to web pages. Now, what you do is you go to modules, HTML pages management, and you go to this your list of web pages, and you'll come up with none. Well, let's actually do that here. We'll go. We're logged in. Um, this is a different version, so here we go. It's still got an administration panel. Uh, users and groups. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna have to go to advanced mode. I think there we go. Advanced mode. Simple, ad simple mode. Advanced mode. Advanced mode. That's gonna unlock the HTML page management. Now there'll be none there. Uh, let's go create an advanced mode. Don't even worry about the HTML code. Let's go home page. Just name it home page, and just type in this is my forum home page and you can add all kinds of HTML code in there let's just do a simple just a simple text to make it work and look do you, do you wish to use your forum header and footer no use this home page as your phone home page this page is home page no let's yes now if you choose yes it says you need to insert if this is your home page it will, every other page it's fine you don't need to put this link on it at all if if yes, you, you have to insert a link to forumation.com. They're a little advertisement. They force you to put an advertisement. I've got a way around that. Let's go Dreamweaver. Just make it the quick way. So this is the link. Come on, load. HTML and what we'll do just delete all that shit refresh now formation.com oh, stop refreshing now we'll on the link formation.com there we go we've got a link so what we can do we can actually change formation.com to a simple space you can do it as a dot to space should work I'm not sure but it should work so it'll be a link, but it'll be invisible. The the name of the link will be invisible. Let's see if that works. I don't know if it's going to work. Let's see what happens. Let's preview. This is my forum homepage. Submit. Successfully created. Okay. Let's... Let's try it. Let's try our homepage. Jeremy Martin at formation.com. Alright. No, it's not working homepage. Why isn't it working? Use this as homepage. Maybe I didn't tick that. Let's try that again. Okay, something. Oh, here it goes until you insert a link so it's not going let's try it it's got a link here we suggest you use the following link let's replace it and what we'll do let's try a, a simple dot oh, whoops I forgot to use this home page that works okay now I've just got this little dot dotty thing here. Now what I can do is I can just change. I can use the old school HTML codes to make this uh, in white. Make instead of black, I can make it white, so it'll be invisible. Or just make it the same color as whatever background of color I've got of the web page, and just mess with the co code. Do that. You can act, you can hide this thing. It'll just look. It'll take you to formation. You can hide it. There's all kinds of ways you can hide it. In fact, you could hide it as that as that full stop there, and you wouldn't even know. That's just on your home page. You need a link to Formation. Or you can just use the proper link if you want. You just use the whole proper link that they give you. Doesn't matter. But you can hide it if you want. So from there, we'll go HTML Pages Management. And you can make, there's a home page, and I can just, um, how do I, Where's the uh, click create an advanced mode create? I recommend creating advanced mode so that you can just use basic HTML web page, just stuff that you put in a web page normally, and just make your own web. You make your own whole website, just make different web pages that way, and just link them link them to each other. 
and use the dash forum link. So in case you um, rename the web page, it'll still it'll still work. So there you can make your own forum. You can make your own uh, website within that forum. And we'll just do it. Um, just make a shortcut to your forum, obviously. Now, obviously, I've got no link here. I can't go anywhere. I can't go to my forum from this. So I better actually make a, a link to my forum. Now, what I do, I go dash forum. There we go. Just so this actually works, let's edit that. I do. We'll make a. We'll make a link. A link to forum. And we'll just call it by name. Enter. We'll copy that, and we'll just add some breaks so there's a space there. And now, refresh. There we go. Enter. At least we got a link we can enter the form. And there we go. We enter the form. You don't have. We don't have to have a home page. We can. You can hide a whole website within your form, and no one, no one would know unless they go to the headings and they try H two. You go to any any free forum like a forum motion, and you just go H five dot forum, and if they've got a hidden heading, it'll actually load there. Now, obviously, there's not one here; it'll just go to default straight to the forum. But if they've got hidden web pages, that's how you find them. You just go H number dash forum. In fact, let's go. Promotion website. Um, let's see if we can find a formation form. Let's just say world, formation World of Warcraft. What a world! There we go. World of Warcraft. Formation. Com. Let's go to it. Okay. Let's see if they've got any headings. H. Uh, let's go h1 dash forum no they haven't got any but if you go to any formation website and, and you'll be able to tell her they got any they, this this web this forum hasn't made any custom web pages if it doesn't work it'll just default so you can name all this you can make your own categories just go to general categories and forums just mess around with this, plus add, modify, all kinds of stuff, and use that code that I gave. Oops, wrong one. Just um, change that if you want to add an image and just replace it with your own image, with your own link. You do an image shack link, but if, if you do that, you don't have a, a safe permanent web space for your images, give it a year or two and you might find that your forum links don't work anymore because it, the image is gone. So we can just do a look and go, we're already logged in. Let's post new topic. Hello world. This is my first topic. Blah, blah, blah. And you got all different kind of stuff here. Now, as I've said about by using basic uh, web code, now see this standard bold, bold, and everything in between that is actually going to come out as bold. Preview. Now we actually see it comes out as bold. These are old school HTML tags. They all work just like your own days. And it's, let's see if the color works as well. Testing color. We'll highlight it. This might be it here. Color red. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, it's a little bit different than the the old oh, HTML. Just use it as a color command. But depending on your forum, they basically use a lot of different old school type of codes. This won't actually work in HTML. But but it, it's really basic. And um, there we go. See, you can insert YouTube videos. Just basically build your own web page out of a forum post. Let's send and successfully. There we go. Now we go, Jeremy Martin, anonymous forum. 
your first forum, hello world, and there's our first topic in our first message. There's tons of stuff you can do. Figure it out. Ask me if you want to know how. Have a look at billboards. See if there's anything on billboards you want to work out how to do yourself. Ask me and I'll show you how. I haven't done anything on that for ages, but I should be able to figure out how, how I did it. You can make things work how they're not supposed to and make them do some really cool stuff. And you go, you change your profile picture and all that kind of stuff. All works fine. So that's how you can make your own for free forum and you can actually make your own website hidden within that forum. And you just use links to the different pages. So try it out. You can have your own forum for free and you can make it in seconds and you don't have to pay for web space or anything like that. It'll load just fine. Alright, done with this video.